Hey guys, this is Christopher Parham, otherwise known as IceQ57. Um, I'm doing a video just to show how I charge my 14S battery on my 406 Duo. Here we have a partially discharged battery, 55.5 volts. This is from my ride last night. I unzip my bag and this is how the wiring looks like. Um, here we have the balance taps for the two 6S groups and here's the balance tap for the 2S group. And here's the series plug that series all the packs together. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to disconnect this. So all right, by second. disconnecting that, that breaks the series connection. So what I would then do is uh, connect my parallel charge cable. And basically what this does is this parallels the two 6S groups uh, for charging and then the third plug goes to the other port of the charger to charge the 2S battery. So this plug can only go in one way. So I'm going to go ahead and plug that in right All now. Right, so right now my charge cable is plugged in and you go down to the charger. One port reads 23.8, the other one reads 7.8. Nine five. So what I would then do is take my parallel balance tap cable, which will basically parallel all six of those batteries down there, so I can parallel charge them. And remember, the plug was right here. So I'm going to plug these in, and then the balance, the balance of the pack should show right, up on so the charger. So I got those balance cables plugged in. You got the balance showing down there on the charger. Let me plug in my last group here. All right, we have our 2S group down there. And then, so I'm about to start the charge cycle. This is a two port charger, so it's like having two chargers in one. Okay, I have everything plugged up. Got my main leads plugged in. Got my balance tops plugged in. We have uh, 23.8 on one port. That's uh, we're going to charge all of my 6S batteries in parallel on one port and then the 2S batteries up there for my booster pack will be charged on the second port so and I'm going to be charging them at 15 amps uh, per side because I have a 750 watt power supply back there I could charge definitely charge much faster but this is just the stay in the limits of the power supply so um, I'm going to show how I would start this up. Basically I'll hit stop to start here. Uh, lipo charge. Everything is already set up. Cells are set to auto current 15 amp and then I have my own balancing settings. So I set user balance or you can set slow or whatever. So I'm gonna just go over here and um, highlight start. Start that over there port 1 starts charging. I'm going to go over here to port 2, hit stop start. Um, start the lipo charge. It's set to auto also, 15 amps. Go ahead and hit start over here. Alright, so I now have both ports. Um, charging this one's uh, charging at 15 amps this one is charging at 15 amps also it's also balanced it will also start balancing the packs and so when it gets done basically I disconnect everything up here disconnect this lead disconnect these two leads disconnect my charge cable I plug this back into this zip everything back up and I'm ready to roll thanks for watching